What do transportation professionals look like? You're going to need computer scientists, data scientists, electrical engineers, sensors, networking. You're going to need those skills in the future. I feel that's what we need, you know, that sort of revolutionary mind. The advantage of being young is you look at this with fresh eyes. Every time we can bring new ideas, new people, it just benefits the whole industry. Every little thing that we do is in the effort to help someone else. And if that's who you are on the inside, I think this is a great industry for you to find that. You're helping people. You're changing society. You're changing the planet. What will the transportation of tomorrow look like? This evolution requires new ways of thinking, from new ranks of inventive thinkers, and from another century of continued support and leadership from the Transportation Research Board. What radical ideas will define our future? Smart cars, connected cars. Flying cars. Teleportation. We could be doing that. We really are making this up as we go along. What will vehicles look like? What will power them? Do we not use the traditional fuel anymore? Do we use alternate energy? How will we navigate the roadways? There are traffic control nightmares out there that we haven't even conceived of yet. Will we even have roadways? It's difficult to be certain. What we do know is this. To serve as the foundation of our future, transportation must be transformative, sustainable, safe, and secure. How will we enable the transformative changes that await us? The 3D printing essentially enables us to free ourselves from traditional manufacturing processes using this automated equipment as opposed to human labor. We can expect drones to be commonplace, not only for deliveries, but also for infrastructure inspection and maintenance. Autonomous travel will become routine. But for all their rich and abundant promise, these and other innovations also promise to be disruptive. We can't even predict exactly what those modes are, much less what their effects are going to be yet. The implications of autonomous vehicles will ripple through fields as diverse as emergency medicine, insurance, and legal services. We definitely need to look at those ADA standards, that everybody has access to that transportation solution. How will we untangle transportation's impact on our climate and our personal well-being and balance competing interests at the same time? The profession is changing. It's not just about building roads or building uh, pavements. It's about making sustainable cities and making sure that things work for the economy, the environment and health. To have a sustainable network requires using the right ingredients and sometimes reusing them. We don't want to take a lot of those natural resources again and again and again. And that's when the recycling comes really critical. Bike sharing, car sharing, ride hailing, ride sharing. Bring all these modes together for sustainable transportation. How do we create the safeguards to ensure our protection? The greatest aspiration looking forward to the next 50 years would be zero deaths on all public roads. But threats to our personal security aren't limited to the roadway. Data protection will become increasingly important. The more valuable information is, the more people will want to steal it. Even national security comes into play as cross-border shipping evolves and becomes routine. Some things remain constant. Our economic prosperity and quality of life will continue to rely on transportation. Transportation improvements will continue to rely on research, creation of new ideas, innovative approaches to old and new problems. So many new things happening in the transportation world that weren't true 20 years ago. Only one thing about tomorrow seems certain, the future of transportation won't be a simple extension of its past. We're gonna end up with an industry that is more diverse than any other industry that I think is out there. Uh, mainly because our problem touches everyone. 
Tomorrow's transportation leaders, with help from the Transportation Research Board, will define our future by disseminating knowledge, promoting diversity, and transferring technology. This is the time for us to dip our toes in new waters and figure out what we're passionate about. You can write your own destiny. You're making the world a better place. You can save your own little piece of the world. 